Trust the Profits and Playup Race Book present the live reaction, analysis, and recap of the 2022 Breeders' Cup Juvenile Turf Sprint. So here we go. It's it's time, uh, hombre. But we are on the five. I think we are kind of in agreement on that. Hopefully the five can show up and at least hit the board for us here. All of us. All of us have been uh, very high on this five. Mischief Magic, who had a decent fourth versus Great Group 1 runners at Newmarket. One of the five European invaders in this race. You've also got Tyler's Tribe, number 10, uh, who's got a Ooh, great five story. Five got a bad, bad five. start there. Yikes. Five did not break well. Not what we want to see in a five and a half for long race. Uh, and we'll keep our eye on Platinum Queen there on the outside. Seems to be uh, really. There's your big story. Them. Tyler's Tribe jumping right up there to the lead. The Platinum Queen what is do you really expect? This is going to be a quick one. Tyler's Tribe and Speedboat Beach up front. Yeah, let's see that time, how fast they're actually going. Who's We got um, American Apple on the inside at 51 to 1, who I do have on my Exacta. So let's see this one go all the way. I'd love that. Wow. Uh, gets a nice turn on the inside. Platinum Queen uh, is outside. Persian Dramatized coming up the rail to four. Here comes the six. And Dramatized, who you liked. Here comes the three. Private Creed. There comes the five. Get up with that five. five out of nowhere, baby. Five. Come on, get there, baby. Get five. Bada boom, bada hey. bing. We nice. are on the board. Race one, <laughs> Breeders' Cup. Ladies and gentlemen, that's awesome. What do you go wow. off at? About I think he was about eight to one. He was getting hammered at the end there. Six to one split horses, and you had been saying it all before we jumped on. It's the Irish horses we were looking out for, uh, and split right through Private Creed, and uh, I believe Dramatized there as well. So what a great start for us! That was a really nice uh, run by Billy Buick and. As Matt DeSantis on this channel has said time and time again, how well Charlie Appleby does <clears throat> uh, in this Breeders' Cup. I seriously wrote him off after getting out of the gate like that. Oh, my goodness. So that was a uh, totally stumble at the start and hopped, it looked like. And that close there, I mean, that's that's why these turf juveniles are so unpredictable. You cannot, you cannot hang on the favorites here. And what's it end up coming? I think it was five four three or five three four. I think it was five three four. Nope, five four three. Dramatized. Uh, dramatized got up. Those were the we we talked about the Irish horses up front. Do you have that exacta? Nope, I had a try box with with uh, both of those in it, but I did not have the three. So, yeah, but we're on the board heavy with the five. Yeah. That was awesome. That was my major bet for the first race. Good start. And the always unpredictable juvenile. And we didn't see Platinum Queen at all. Uh, no. That's uh, Speedboat. And look at the Queen. look at the move by Billy Buick. There was yeah. no room there. That was really Squeezes impressive. Squeezes between the three and six there. And he had all kinds of horse. That was super impressive. And to have the confidence um, to split outside that six there was, you could see that. Oh man, look at this. Six got fourth. If it came five, four, six, we would have been in good shape there. But Private Creed snuck in, no surprise. Yeah, really Very cool, good. man. That was that's a great start for the profits. Did our homework. Like you said, Matthew DeSantis was on that horse. We were on that horse. The numbers gave us that horse. We did not like Platinum Queen, who had never been in this type of race before. It looks like that exact five four will pay sixty six dollars for the one dollar bet. So if you had that exacta, that's nice. I know on doubling down that I had that five to kick off uh, the double here. So hopefully we can get that home in the next race. And this is just what you want to do in your first race. It makes you feel nice and confident. <laughs> yeah, let's move. The next race is going to be wide open again. So we'll see you soon. Thanks, everybody, for joining. We're going to cover all these with the same, uh, hopefully, uh, positive enthusiasm. Colin. Let's keep nice it rolling. Job. One for one. Peace. Let's go. Thanks for watching Trust the Profits, your home for the best in horse racing and sports analysis.